see here. All right. Here we're going to share the next episode of Hero Comics. Hate mail. Mm-hmm. Transgender hate mail. Homosexual hate mail. Atheist hate mail. And a bunch of other stuff, too. Uh, these are is basically me reacting to bunches you know, of comments and you know, screen caps of, of comments and videos. Uh, you know, little comments that I put on that were uh, in response to comments I posted on videos and other posts of people on YouTube and DeviantArt against these Deviant lifestyles. And a few other things. Uh, trigger warning words like penis, vagina, uterus, ovaries, testicles, and vulva will be used in these videos. I am a Bible believing Christian, so I say I'm going to take you off. The people that say that Christian believe in the Bible, what well, they say I'm going to take you off. The people that say that God is evil, which is wrong, or uh, God does not exist, which is wrong, and what well, they say I'm going to take you off. Also, the people who uh, don't say they're Christian but don't believe in the Bible, uh, that stuff really messes them up. Um, uh, there will be no screen cap shown because, you know, yeah, because. Um, and my brother has informed me that they are, they could be seen as evidence of harassment. You know, back in the old days, of course, I would show you the screen caps front and center <laughs> because I wanted to show you the evidence. You know, I would basically block out the names and icons because I didn't want to, that to mess with people's reputations. But uh, still, apparently, that's not good enough. <laughs> apparently, people you know, can still get you, get uh, mess you around, mess around. Because yeah, when when someone says you know they call it harassment, because when someone says someone is posting uh, content that says basically they would like to they they uh, think about you know, taking their own you know basically ending it all because um, someone only because they don't like well, the way they 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 look or uh, the way their body looks or sounds or what natural normal thing it does like menstruate. Um, and I say here's here you know there's no need to do that here are the biblical reasons why here are the uh, you know the scientific reasons why uh, I believe this and they can say that's harassment because uh, they aren't thinking straight so they, have, they will not be any names or icons talked about shown or talked about because it's not about who said what mm-hmm. All right. specifically it's about what the people who believe this way believe and why I must stand against it mm-hmm. so let's continue on here we had an awesome comment about uh, it was uh, Ask Laura the awesome Flash animated cartoon awesome animated YouTube you know, cartoon that's on YouTube mm, by Tomo Canal and uh, basically it was episode comments on an episode where uh, Alora, the cute protagonist girl, and one of her friends, no, one of her friends who's a boy, uh, kind of developed a crush on each other and kissed, and had a kiss. Um, uh, you know that was that was it was a wonderful idea, mm-hmm. wonderful, wonderful fun, a lot of fun dealing with. Basically, this show talks about dealing with strange new feelings. You know, mm-hmm. oh, that's puberty. Part of puberty is dealing with the strange new feelings of attraction mm-hmm. to uh, each other, and so they, they deal with it in a pretty good way. You know, I like that show a lot. Mm-hmm. You know, I did a review on that. You know, yeah, it was great. So let's get. But, but I was trying to continue on. Let's go. Okay, this stuff will be in, no, in a new order. Mm-hmm. Okay, back in the old days, back in a little while ago, when I was starting making videos like these. Um, the this this the uh, hate mail was in uh, a uh, basically in a weird order. Uh, but I, I forgot about just, like, I forgot I could so- sort it by date. <laughs> you know, so yeah, we could we could fix this up. So we're going in. Let's go next. Okay, I'm really attracted. Selected uh, live stream. Huh? Selected quarantine live stream. Oh, yeah, that was nice. Mm-hmm. 2020 stuff. Mm-hmm. Quarantine live stream. So many cool songs are selected. Mm, you know, not sponsored. <laughs> I'm not sponsored by selected. But there's a lot of cool stuff going on. I like seeing selected and a bunch of other um, fun uh, artists. The fun uh, channels where they talk. They show off of some really awesome, amazing music. Mm, so yeah, music, dance music, and whatnot. So yeah, mm, it's really great. So let's go. Next. Oh yeah. Also, apparently there is uh, stuff on here that I did censor the names and icons of. Mm, okay, a long time ago, and you know, basically. But yeah, I don't need to do that anymore because, of course, I'm not showing you the screen caps, but uh, still have the screen caps from when I censored them. Mm, you know, using MS Paint, mm, something like that. And all things. Let's continue on here. How much time do I have first? Check that. Also, I got. Uh, I shade. I basically uh, got. I got a little trim there. Mm, little shade there. You know. Like a little more uh, clean cut, so yeah, yeah. Well, you could say it's a quarantine uh, shade. <laughs> yeah. not, the, not the most professional, but it, it, it works. So let's get on here. Then we go to another one. Okay, this is from I, I don't know if I can even say the title, but what I can say is that there is a lot of issues with the transgender lifestyle. 
And one of those issues is you have people who were born with ovaries, women, who are saying they're, they're dudes now. But here's the problem. They're men. People want testicles now. And so, but then there's a problem you know, with this because, of course, they're female, born with ovaries. So basically, they have to deal with female things until they, of course, poison their bodies enough that they don't. So... One of the things they have to do with, of course, is uh, the biggest thing is uh, menstruation. So, yeah, there's a video. There's video. There was a video out about uh, uh, this one girl, person with ovaries, who's saying she's a, a, a boy, person with testicles now, and that she's basically dealing with uh, feminine hygiene products. Mm -hmm. Say feminine hygiene products. I don't know if I can say the video, but I can say feminine hygiene products from uh, basically uh, you know for trans guys, mm -hmm. like. You girls, <laughs> no, <laughs> like yeah, yes you do. But anyway, I say this is informative, but sad. You do not need to hide the fact that you're female from people. This is perfectly normal. That is perfectly normal. If someone doesn't like it, then that's their problem with them, not your body. You know. And then someone says he's not a girl though. Though she's talking about feminine hygiene products and using them for her period. And I say yes, she is. She was born with ovaries, with a vagina, uterus, and ovaries. They to female reproductive organs and someone says he isn't a girl well, i say yes she is she doesn't have to act like one though that's where she's getting confused and someone says hey we'll call your comics he is a trans man and a girl wants to be a boy and i say uh, and someone else says he will call us he's a trans man as stated above he isn't confused yes she is <laughs> he's just sharing his experience to try and help others will help with other trans males and girls want to be boys <laughs> i'm like yeah no <laughs> anyone and I say, trans men, aka women that want to be men, need to learn to accept their bodies as is and stop trying to deceive people into thinking that they, thy, are men. <laughs> like, they're wrong. Thy, they are men. The only difference between men and women is their reproductive organs. Mm, true. Mm. Someone else says, here comes, bruh, if you're transphobic, why are you on a trans guy's channel laughing my butt off? Mm. Don't cuss. You remember know, that word. And someone says, ugh, a turf. Mm. You know, I don't know what that meant at the time, but I don't know. Uh, so a feminine, mm, feminist, basically, mm, a feminist of a certain kind who's like uh, against the the people, you know, people born with ovaries, you know, uh, saying that they're they're male mm, because it's a lie. Mm, so yeah, mm, I, I like these people. Mm, I like uh, these turfs. Mm, yeah, mm, so someone says hero comics. No, dysphoria exists. You need to acknowledge that. Mm, and I say I all I know is this existence. I also know that must be resisted because it will make you do stupid things like any other kind of fear. Now, here's the problem. A lot of people say that uh, dysphoria isn't fear because they're confused, <laughs> but it is. So, yeah, what am I talking about? Forget that. Uh, isn't fear because they're confused? So, yeah. Mm. I'm going to help them see that it is because, my gosh, these people are freaking out. <laughs> Literally freaking out, doing horrible things. You know, it's just because they're so afraid of what could happen. <laughs> it's not cool. Anyone here? So it says, dysphoria is not a, hero comics, dysphoria is not a fear and shouldn't be ignored. And I say, yes, it is. It makes people freak out about things that are normal. And someone else says, hero comics, they aren't scared of their body. They hate their body because they're scared of it. <laughs> it's not the body they want because they're scared of it. <laughs> their body doesn't align with their gender because they're scared of it. <laughs> it's not a fear. Yes, it is. <laughs> go, go, go. And someone else says, here, hero comics, here's some research for you to read. That's wrong. About trans people. I suggest you do not send, uh, you do not, suggest you do not to, you know, I suggest you not to send wiki leaks, as that's pretty simple considering there are wiki page for gender dysphoria and trans people too. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, a, a counter <laughs> saying, well, I suggest you don't try to counter this stuff <laughs> this way. You know? And shows off different links of different things. I won't you know, bother, I won't, uh, you know, basically, uh, uh, yeah, yeah dignify them with uh, uh, any type of uh, respect or uh, any, of any type of shadow of any kind at all because they they're all wrong. Uh, do you want to hear? Also, after reading this, if you still think trans people don't exist, which is not what I said, then I hate to break it to you, but you are extremely close minded, childish for clinging to your own to your opinion, even though science says otherwise in the science of surveys. Uh, kind of similar. Too, as scientists, survey scientists, definitely know more about that than you, know, than you about trans people. Our intelligent studies for this have valued facts and truth above anything else. Value facts and truth above anything else. Oh, yeah, right. Uh, not listening to them would be ignorant. If you don't understand, as you do understand, and now respectfully use the pronoun of nounces, <laughs> the pronounces trans people use. <laughs> 
Okay, all that time. So I'll see you guys next time. Check me out on YouTube and DeviantArt. Leave me on here. Oh my gosh.